Hello guys, welcome to my channel Netcash on Webpix Zone. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn how to use Google Drive in your Android phone. So, I am going to show you my Android phone. So, let's start with the video. Before we start, I request you if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe my channel, and don't forget comments below. So, let's go on my mobile screen. <coughs> so, here you can see I am on my Android phone. So, I am going to show you from starting. So, first, I will show you how you can download the Google Drive from Android phone. So, let it Okay, so you can download Google Drive from Play Store. Open Play Store from your phone and type here Google Drive. Or you can simply type the drive here. So just download it, and after download, you can open it. So if you first time open it, it will be asked you to log in. So if you have already uh, added Google account or Gmail account on your phone. So here you can see the you have to they asking you to choose the Google account. But if you don't uh, uh, did not uh, add the any account Google account in your device, then first you have to add the account in your Google or you can add from here also. Just click here and you can add account from here. I have already add. Just add account. Just you have to use Google account to use Google Drive. So add account here and it will be show like this. Okay. So I have only one account here, so I just use it. Okay. So this is my or folder which I have in my Google Drive and this is my computer folder. This is basically you have to synchronize with your computer folder. Okay, how you can synchronize your folder from computer. If you want to learn this, you can see my another video. I just I can if you want I can give the links in the description. Okay. So this is for computer, but don't go this option if you want to go you can learn from how you can add the folder from computer in drive so for now just come to the my drive and this is a folder i have created or i have uploaded in google drive and there are file also you can see pdf file phd files okay images also okay i can add so this is file tab where you can find all your folder file of your google drive or this is a home where you will see the all shortcuts uh, which you have recently used okay so i use this video i just uploaded this video you can say i use share this video it means i have uh, you know operate this uh, this my activities like you can, this is suggestion like it is like history you can see there's all file and folder which i operated earlier it will be show here okay and this is my notification if you get any notification from google drive team so it will be show here if somebody share folder or file it will be notification will be here okay and here you can do the click the three line option and here you can see the all recent uh, recent activities uh, you can use offline of your google drive you can this is trash okay when you delete anything so it will be go to the trash folder and it will be there for 30 days okay you can uh, uh, restore it within 30 days or you can delete Permanently by going uh, in trash folder and you can delete it. Backups means if you click it, so no, uh, the, not the device owner, you must be device owner to manage backup for this device. Okay, in backup, you will find your WhatsApp backup and all backup. Okay, I don't have any backup in, so there is no any data. So here you can setting, in setting, you will find the option. Okay, you can change the themes, you can clear the caches, you can check the size of caches, you can transfer file only Wi Fi. If you want to upload a big file in RAV, then you have to, you can use Wi Fi only, or sometimes what happen you just upload the file on your mobile network, then it will be consumed your data. So make sure if you want to save your mobile data, so upload only on Wi Fi, just on it. Okay and here and this is total memory you have used i have used 420 mb out of 15 gb okay so there is a 15 gb memory free from google drive and if you want to upload uh, upgrade you can upgrade from here okay so simply and this is start it okay start it means if you want to start some uh, some file so it will be added here it like shortcuts of your important file so if you want to make this important file i have to click on this three line and i have to add on start it so if i click on start it it will be you can show you see here this start it file okay so it is it is like short course of particular file okay so this is shared folder okay 
so someone if this is tap for shared folder or file okay so basically here you can see all file and folder which is shared by others okay you can see there is a tiny human icon to a human icon means people uh, has shared something okay this is all file which is shared by others it is not my file it is shared by others okay so I can operate and you know I can check this file so how you can share your file to others if you want to see it you can check my other video if you want I can put the link in description just comment so now if you click on this three dot you can see that if you click on manage people here you can see uh, this person has shared with me and this is me okay so this is owner uh, this is not me this is me so I'm editor only that this person shared share file with me so I can operate okay you can share one file or folder to up to 50 people so, okay so if you want to working if you if you work in office or if you have team that if you uh, some data that you need to access from many people then you can use uh, this option or folder to operate particular file okay so here yeah, now I show you how you can upload the files go to the files and here you can see the plus icon and you can create the folder okay if you want to upload some particular files or you like for example if you want to create folder for office work only so you can create a folder like just click and office work and just click on create then folder will be created here so okay so folder created so here just refresh just hold down it will be refreshed and you have to find this folder which I created okay this I just created open it and into this particular folder you can upload file okay you can upload excel sheet okay just click on upload and you can upload folders from your mobile or file okay here you can see you can upload from your photos you can upload from download you can upload from videos here you can see also you can filter the documents only from your phone if you are using the update android phone so just upload file from here or it will be upload here okay so come back so now if you click on again plus one you can scan document okay you can scan anything from here you have to operate your phone camera and then you can scan document physical document here i just deny if you want to scan any document and you want to save in google drive you can simply scan and just show it so you can create new google docs file you can create google sheet file and and you can create the google sheet file in google drive okay so that is basic knowledge i just give you if you want to use the more feature of google drive you can use the desktop mode so guys i hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching